this is proof right here that the UFC is completely owned by the Illuminati. We've got George St. Pierre here throwing up the Illuminati triangle of the Illuminati. P the only people that throw this up is the ones that have sold the soul because when they throw up the triangle it simulates the alliance to Satan and the Illuminati. The beast is saying, I'm one of you. I mean, and then we got this devil horns, throwing the devil horns up, two fingers up, two fingers in, promoting the devil. Then we got here, 666 hand sign, throwing it up twice, promoting the mark of the beast. And then we've got basically Michael Bisping. He's got a snake, the red snake. What does the snake represent in the Garden of Eden? Satan, the serpent. The snake represents the snow serpent, which is Satan. That's why these people wear a snake, because it's worship of Lucifer and then we've got Conor McGregor not many po people probably even notice this but if you look at his tattoo here all seeing eyes with the Illuminati one two three three all seeing eyes of the Illuminati the one eye symbolism I mean, most of these people are monarch mind controlled. I mean, there was basically an interview with Conor McGregor where they asked him a question and he was just sat there in his own and didn't move or didn't say anything. See, these people are monarch programmed to fulfill a Illuminati agenda. Well, as we can see, and this is not the only symbolism you'll see in the UFC. And as we see more occult symbolism, the devil horns, front of the devil horns, I mean, another sellout, thrown up the Illuminati triangle. I mean, if you think that sports entertainment isn't owned by the Illuminati. Think again, the N NFL, NBA, it's all owned, it's rigged, it's fake, it's all controlled by the elite to keep your attention away from God. As we see, Another sellout from the Illuminati Triangle. I mean, it's proof. Another, notice here the Phoenix. Again, Illuminati Triangle. I mean, it's proof. And then we got here, Illuminati Triangle again. Throwing it up. Throwing the 666 hand sign up twice. Meme. What does that say? The sellouts. No doubt about it. I mean, most of these are on steroids anyway. No doubt about it. False peace sign. I mean, you don't get massive like this without being on steroids. Doesn't happen. Most of them are on gear. They take steroids. But, again, notice the skull. Skull and bones. Skull of death. From the Illuminati triangle again. 
Then you got this person basically got a tattoo of a Illuminati triangle on the back. Proves that the sellouts, no doubt about it. It just proves that, that it's owned by the elite. And as you can clearly see, another fighter. Illuminati Triangle, again. I mean, this is just straight up proof. I mean, honestly, the UFC is completely owned by the elite. There's no doubt about it. As you can see, Illuminati, again. Not even trying to hide it. It says it all. You know what I'm saying? There you go again. Well, as I said, Illuminati Triangle again. Not even trying to hide it. And this is his blasphemous angel wings on his back, portraying himself as an angel. Straight up sell out. I mean, it's completely owned by the elite, no doubt about it. There is no doubt about it. No doubt at all. I mean, honestly, if you look up more of the sellouts, as we see, George Saint Pierre. From the 666 and sign up twice, even more proof that they're owned by the elite. Proof sellouts that are owned by the elite. And honestly, proves that. I mean, A, 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 looks like free, free, free. I mean, honestly, as you can see. And then you basically got the main boss, Dana White, throwing out the devil horns. So, what you expect? Six 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 hands on. So it just shows it's completely owned by the devil. This satanic entertainment, because that's all it is. And as you see, six six six. Mark of the beast. And there we go, Anderson Silva, thrown at the devil horns. This is just so much proof. It's owned by the elite. There's no doubt about it. There's no doubt about it. And you know, as you can see, as you can see here, Thrown up the Illuminati Pyramid. Illuminati Pyramid here. And it's completely owned. Straight owned by Satan. Hurst. <laughs>